So here we are at Budapest, round three of the DTM Championship. Here we are heading down into turn one. Big braking zone, arriving, maximum speed on the track. Very difficult in qualifying to gain the entry support uh, to enable you to do a good lap. After this, quite tricky on traction, and now we head into turn two, which is an off camber, uh, and you fall downhill. A lot of understeer can be brought into the car here. Through turn two, heading to turn three, should be flat, hopefully with a good balance in the car, before heading up to turn five. Very quick corner, very tricky on the entry, not to get pulled in by the, the entry kerb. Over the crest, not to run too wide, before coming into a big long 180 degrees corner. Very important, your entry speed uh, to, to make up the lap time. Down into what's probably the slowest bit on the track, very tight chicane, big kerbs traction quite tricky and before you lead into a very busy part of the lap left right another chicane heading up high speed before the fastest corner on the track all about commitment confidence not looking out not to run too wide on the exit and then heading down the back straight another big braking zone towards the end of the lap you're now heading into the final sector into some two very difficult corners all about how much you can carry speed into the corner without losing the rear of the car. Then you're heading up, you can see the entry to the pits on the right hand side, make sure you don't run too wide before looking to make sure you get the best possible exit heading out the last corner uh, and hopefully that's a lap that you've completed that you're going to be satisfied with and hopefully give Mercedes-Benz um, a great experience here.